Hello everyone, welcome to YouTube channel Learn with Gisela. In this video of polynomials, we shall study division of polynomial by a binomial using long division method. So these are the three questions which we are going to take up in this video. We have to use long division to divide these polynomial by binomial and we have to check our answer. Now there are three steps involved in long division. The first is division, second is multiplication and third is subtraction. That means we have to undergo these three processes to solve our question. Now further we shall use division algorithm to check our answer after we get question and remainder upon dividing the dividend by the divisor. Now division algorithm actually tells us the relationship between the four elements that is dividend, divisor, quotient and remainder. Now for example suppose in the whole number we have 35 divided by 7 is equal to 5. Now if we have to check it we will write these values in the equation that is dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder. So we shall write 35 is equal to 7 into 5 plus 0 and which as we know that 35 is equal to 35. Similarly if we have to divide 37 by 7 we shall get the question 5 and remainder 2. Now further we can check our answer by putting these values in the division algorithm. So we shall write 37 is equal to 7 into 5 plus 2. That is 37 is the dividend, 7 is the divisor, 5 is the question and 2 is the remainder. Now naturally the left hand side is equal to right hand side because 7 into 5 plus 2 is also 37. Now let us uh, take the case of a polynomial where 6 x cube is divided by 3x square. Both are monomials and divided with each other and we get 2x as the quotient. Now over here we can say 6x cube is the dividend, 3x square is the divisor and 2x is the quotient and 0 is the remainder. Further we can check the answer by putting these values in the division algorithm and we shall write 6x cube is equal to 3x square into 2x plus 0. Now further 6x cube is equal to 6x cube therefore we can say left hand side is equal to right hand side. So this is how we check our answer using division algorithm. Now let us start with the second question. It is given divide 12z cube plus 4z plus 3z square plus 1 by 4z plus 1. Now first of all we shall write the dividend in the standard form that is we have to write in the decreasing order of the powers. So first we will write 12z cube followed by plus 3z square plus 4z plus 1 to be divided by 4z plus 1. Now we shall set a problem. 4z plus 1 will come outside and the dividend that is 12z cube plus 3z square plus 4z plus 1 we shall write inside. Now we shall start with the first step that is division. So we shall take up the first term of the dividend and divide it by the first term of the divisor. So we shall write 12z cube upon 4z which is equal to 3z square. Now this is our question which we will write on the top. Another way of finding 3z square is think of a number what should be multiplied to 4z to get 12z cube. So that way also you can do it. Now second step is multiplication, multiplying the divisor with the quotient. So we shall write 4z plus 1 into 3z square which is equal to 12z cube plus 3z square. Now this will come just below 12z cube plus 3z square which, were, which are the two terms of the dividend and uh, further we shall move to the third step that is subtraction. We have to subtract both so we shall write both in the brackets along with minus sign in between. Now we shall open the brackets and simplify. Uh, so uh, 12z cube will ca uh, get cancelled with minus 12z cube and 3z square will get cancelled with minus 3z square and further we are left with 0. Now this was the horizontal way of doing it. We can do in vertical way and uh, in vertical way first of all we shall write in minus sign uh, just below the product which we had obtained in second step and then we shall, we shall change the sign that means the plus 12z cube will become now minus 12z cube and plus 3z square will become minus 3z square. Now further plus z, uh, 12z cube and minus 12z cube will get cancelled 
Further, 3z square and minus 3z square will also get cancelled. So if both of them have got cancelled, 0 is what is left with us. Now further, we will bring down the next two terms which are there in the dividend. That is 4z plus 1. Now we have to start with all these three steps all over again. So what number do you think we should multiply 4z to get 4z? So the answer is 1. Or another way of doing it to follow the first step that is division. 4z divided by 4z is 1. So that way also you can obtain the new question that is 1. So uh, 1 is the question which we have obtained. We will write on the top uh, just next to 3z square. Now we shall start with the second step that is multiplication. So 4z plus 1 into 1 we shall get 4z plus 1. Now the third step is subtraction. So we shall write minus sign just below them and we will change the sign. When it, the signs are changed we can cancel 4z with minus 4z, 1 with minus 1 and we shall get the remainder 0. Now therefore the question over here is 3z square plus 1 and remainder is 0. Now let's further check our answer using division algorithm. Our dividend is 12z cube plus 3z square plus 4z plus 1. Our divisor is 4z plus 1. Question is 3z square plus 1 and remainder is 0. Now we shall put these values in our division algorithm that is dividend is equal to divisor into question plus remainder. So we shall write 12z cube plus 3z square plus 4z plus 1 is equal to divisor that is 4z plus 1 and quotient that is 3z square plus 1 and plus 0 that is the remainder. Now we shall uh, write the dividend once again 12z cube plus 3z square plus 4z plus 1 is equal to now multiply binomial into binomial. So 4z into 3z square is 12z cube, 4z into 1 is 4z, 1 into 3z square is 3z square and 1 into 1 is 1 and plus 0 as it is. Now further we shall simplify it. We shall write the dividend as it is and on the right hand side we shall uh, solve and write in the standard form you can say. So we shall get 12z cube plus 3z square plus 4z plus 1. So it is actually ex exactly equal to uh, left hand side. So we can say our left hand side is equal to right hand side. Our division algorithm is satisfied. So that means our answer is correct. Now let's move to third question. It is given divide 8x square minus 2 minus 3x plus 12x cube by 4x square minus 1. Now if you observe the dividend is not in standard form. So first of all we shall write in the standard form that is the decreasing order of the powers. So first of all 12x cube plus 8x square minus 3x and minus 2. So like this we will write and to be divided by 4x square minus 1. Now let us set our problem. The divisor that is 4x square minus 1 will come outside and dividend that is 12x cube plus 8x square minus 8x and minus 2 will come inside. Now we shall start with the first step that is division. First term of the dividend to be divided by the first term of the divisor. So 12x cubed divided by 4x square is equal to 3x. So 3x is our question which we will write on the top. Now another way of finding 3x is to think of a number. What should be divided to 4x square to get 12x cubed? So the answer is 3x. So that's how also you can find out the question. Now we shall move to the second step that is multiplication. We shall multiply the divisor with the quotient. So we shall write 4x square minus 1 into 3x which is equal to 12x cube minus 3x. Now while writing it just below the two terms of the dividend we have to be very careful that we write just below the like terms. Like 12x cube will be written just below 12x cube and minus 3x will be written just below minus 3x. We will leave the space for 8x square. We will not write over there anything or you can just add plus 0 over there. And further we shall move to uh, third step that is subtraction. We have to subtract now uh, both uh, what we have obtained as a product and the first two terms of the dividend 
and uh, we shall write in the 2 in the brackets with a minus sign in between. Further, we shall open the brackets and change the signs. And if you observe, 12x cube will get cancelled with minus 12x cube and 3 minus 3x will get cancelled with plus 3x and we are left with 0. Now this was uh, this first step, second step, third step are all part of the working which you need not show in fair. Now in vertical form if we have to show it in the long division process we will just write minus sign beneath 12x cube and minus 3x and change their sign. Now plus 12x cube will become minus 12x cube and minus 3x will become plus 3x. Now further plus 12x cube which was in the dividend will ca get cancelled with minus 12x cube and similarly minus 3x in the dividend will stand cancelled with plus 3x. So now we are left with 0. Further we shall bring down the two terms which are left in the dividend that is 8x square and minus 2. And now we shall start with these three steps all over again. Think of a number what should be multiplied to 4x square to get 8x square. So you can say it is 2. So 2 we will write on the top next to 3x or another way of doing it is the first step that is division. You can divide 8x square by 4x square then also you will get 2. Now we shall move to the second step that is multiplication. So we shall multiply 4x square minus 1 into 2 and we shall get 8x square minus 2. Now further we shall write minus sign just below it and change the sign. Minus will become plus, plus will become minus and 8x square minus 8x square will stand cancel and minus 2 and plus 2 will stand cancel and we are left with 0 as remainder. So over here the question is 3x plus 2 and remainder is 0. Now further let us check the answer using division algorithm. We have the four elements that is dividend, divisor, question and remainder. We shall put these values in the division algorithm that is dividend is equal to divisor into question plus remainder. So we shall write 12x cube plus 8x square minus 3x minus 2 is equal to 4x square minus 1 into 3x plus 2 that is our divisor into question and plus 0 that is our remainder. Now further we shall write dividend as it is 12x cube plus 8x square minus 3x minus 2 and further we shall simplify the two binomials that is uh, we shall take up the first term of first binomial and multiply with both the terms of the second binomial and then we shall multiply minus 1 with both the terms of the second binomial. So we shall start uh, like this 4x square into 3x is 12x cube and 4x square into 2 is 8x square. Further minus 1 into 3x is minus 3x and minus 1 into 2 is minus 2 and plus 0. Now further we shall just simplify it. Uh, minus 2 and plus 0 is just minus 2. So we, we will write 12x cube plus 8x square minus 3x minus 2 is on the left hand side that is the dividend which we have carried forward and 12x cube plus 8x square minus 3x minus 2 is the right hand side what we have observed and they are both same that means our division algorithm is satisfied and our answer is correct. So hope you have understood these types of questions where we are dividing a polynomial by a binomial using long division method. So hope you have enjoyed the video. Uh, please do like and subscribe and leave your comments in the comment box. Thank you everyone.